Hi, Dr. Frank Johnson from Sports Medicine Ultrasound. I'm here to demonstrate a cortisone injection into a knee. My patient is an avid soccer player, been playing his whole life, wants to continue playing. Unfortunately, he's had some significant injuries to the left knee requiring an ACL reconstruction, and there's been two significant injuries to this right knee also requiring surgery. We're having symptoms on the, the medial joint line, but to get cortisone into the knee joint, what we do is we simply go into the suprapatellar recess. Again, the old way would be to go through the front and hope you're in the knee joint. Another way would be to go under the patella, but the trouble is you're definitely going to hit the femur or the patella if you do that. But if we use ultrasound, we can identify the fluid within the suprapatellar recess and pop the needle in almost painlessly. It's not gonna be completely painless, but it's gonna be an amazing injection. You're gonna love it. It's gonna work great too. All right, so what do we see? Right hand side of the screen, patella. Here's the quadriceps tendon. Here's the suprapatellar fat pad. Bottom of the screen, we see the femur and the prefemoral fat pad. Between the two is a little bit of synovial fluid. It's a little hard to see, so I'm gonna sweep to the lateral third of the patella and see if I can see a bit more fluid. Well, I can definitely see the prefemoral fat pad better, but I can't see the fluid perfectly, and I know the femoral condyle's there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm simply gonna flex the knee into about 60 degrees of flexion. Go ahead, we'll get up to about there, perfect. And what that does is that allows a little bit of fluid to pop out, and actually that's a little bit too much. So let's go down, I'll straighten it a bit, perfect. That's about as good as I can get. I'm gonna add a little bit more skin disinfectant as my ultrasound signal transducer. I'm now gonna rotate the probe 90 degrees. And just here on the screen, I can see the articular cartilage of the femur, and just above it, a little bit of joint fluid. Without ultrasound, this would be almost impossible. So I stabilize everything. Little poke. Pass the needle in. Now you can see my needle just there touching the lateral femoral condyle. All I have to do is make it rise just a touch above and just there. I'm actually into a fluid compartment. And if I inject the fluid, you can see it flowing all the way over to the right hand side of the screen. That's it. That's our intra-articular knee joint injection into the suprapatellar recess.